lovely viewers welcome to edge varieties once again you know have you ever seen someone who is 40 years but looking like 70 years mommy have you mm. <laughs> <laughs> this one that uh, issue <laughs> yeah yeah because i knew a lot of youths they look they look in in age they are they are young in age but appearance wise they look like 70 80s hey. like someone who is 80 years and 70 years i don't i don't know if i'm past though <laughs> Unless you tell us your age, so that we'll be able to define. Oh, okay, okay, I'll, I'll tell you in the comment section. So make sure you, you enter the comment section. So, mm. so what you are saying is really true. Oh, it's really true. Because yeah. a lot of people around, you see them when they mention their age. Ah, you might think the person is seventy or oh, eighty, yeah, sure, like sure. you said. I don't know. Uh -huh. What may be the cause? What could be? Good. That's mm. a, a a nice question okay. that we need to. Talk about so this is what we are going to dilate on today. Oh, okay, now, sure. aging we know is a natural process. Mm. Whatever you do, you are going to age. Whatever you do, you age. But then you can slow down. You don't have to hasten your aging process. Okay. And so what you have said or you've been seeing mm. is true. Someone 20 will look like 40, someone 40 will look like a hundred year old person. And the causes are there are certain foods that can hasten or quicken aging process fast. Oh, okay. So these foods, do you know some of them? I think alcohol is bad. Good. Those who drink alcoholic beverages, they make it part of their life. Without a day, they cannot. Uh, uh, what? From six to six. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, the last time I was going to the uh, to the market, the market early morning. Mm. That morning, come and see these guys and these ladies. I don't know. I don't know what. In fact, they are. They look puffy. They look older. They mm. look uh, weaker. Why? Because that early morning, they went to the Gogoro Akwetenshi. It's very bad. You see, very bad. and they are you used know. to it. So you see them, you compare your age, mm -hmm. and then those us, those who do not take alcohol, but they like taking alcohol. Alcohol yeah. can slow down your, your your mm -hmm. aging. Too much intake. Yes, right? Too it, much intake. it makes you look what older. Yeah, for us, mm. you you are younger in age. Yeah. Mm. So what about coffee? Coffee, coffee is also another mm. one. Good. Too much coffee, spicy now, food. If you take coffee the right way. Mm. It wouldn't do anything. Mm. So when you take coffee, you have to drink water. Okay. A lot of water so that the caffeine can just pass out mm. in your urine, you see. But then, if you don't do it the right way, then it makes you look Oh, okay. Okay, and, and one thing to uh, I, I learned is, you know, uh, fried, uh, it says fried foods. So now we are uh, talking about drinks. Oh, so okay. let me bring the last one before we get so, so you want to bring the last one yeah the, the last one i think uh, is soda mm. okay uh -huh. soda soda yes. too uh, yes especially a sugared soda yeah mm. so sh uh, soda would dehydrate you mm. so these are some of the drinks that we need to avoid then when it comes to food i think you can help us with yeah. the foods that can help us age fast uh, it's a fried foods you know mm. like so at times we do fry rice and the, the, the main thing that makes it bad is like when we fry them at a higher temperature, mm -hmm. you know, like they said, they produce some free radicals that cause our cellular damage. So we should try fry these foods at a low temperature. That's good, you know, we can fry it to so that the food, the food will become too hot and it's very bad mm -hmm. for the body, you know. You know, one thing is the skin is the, is the, the largest organ of the body, you know, it's the largest organ. And, you know, in, in the line of defense, the skin is is uh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Let's it's, listen to it's you. It also serves as the first line of defense against injury and pathogens. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah, so because of that, we have to take good care of our skin by eating good uh, food and uh, meals that will help us live better or uh, healthy, rather than engaging this kind of soda, alcoholic beverages, and this kind of meals. It's very bad. You know, we have to lower the intake of such. So, so fried food is one. Fried food, yeah. I agree food. with you. Mm. And then one thing again is bread. Bread too. Too bread, much intake of bread. Yes, bread can also 
<laughs> fasting your uh, aging process. Okay, me, I don't take so all these things though. you are mentioning, mm. I don't take them. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, but you do take bread, but not too much intake, right? I don't take bread. Oh wow! <laughs> like seriously? Yes, I've 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 uh, I've omitted bread from my meals for about five years. Oh, now. I mean, I love bread, though. Mm. <laughs> yes, so you can go ahead and be eating. You know, the, the bread. You the, just be looking puff puff. The, the, the bread of like life. Puff, puff. <laughs> <laughs> bread of life. I can't stop it. So bread, all the me. drinks we mentioned, I don't okay. take it. I like my natural things. Mm. I'll make drinks Blended from juices, juices mm. and that's what I take. And then sugar is also one thing yeah. that can also fasten your mm. aging process. You see, it can make you look very old. And then, what again do you think can mm. cause the aging process? Trans fats and charred meats. They are also part. You, know, uh -huh. you have to reduce the intake of those parts. A meaty. Uh, so again, salt. Too much intake of salt, yeah, right? So most of my uh, what meals that I prepare, you see me not adding salt. Okay. Uh -huh, because too much salt can also cause dehydration, mm. which will also fasten aging. Aging. Okay. You will look. Older. It accelerate aging. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So salt is also yeah, very, so we very, have to very lower then, our intake of salt. Yeah. As well. okay. So another thing is spicy food. Yeah. When the food is so spicy, add spices and, you, and stuff. Yeah, mm. a, a whole lot. So most of the cooking channels, yeah, yeah, yeah. white tea, they use a lot too of too much of spicy uh -huh. foods. And this thing, mm. people are learning from it, and they are bringing it in into their home. Okay. So once they continue eating these foods, they will age fast. So viewers, you have to reduce the intake of such. It's very bad. Yeah. Is there any other thing no, that you can I think that would be all. I think that would be all. It's, yeah. it's, it's a lot. So yeah. we can also prevent premature aging. Okay. Yes. Premature aging by avoiding these things. You then you drink a lot of water. Yeah. And mostly what I see is that many people are used to it. They finish eating and then they drink cold water. Oh, okay. So this mm. can also cause the children. Yes, right? the aging uh, process. But am I aging? Yes, you are aging. <laughs> <laughs> How old yeah, are you? You want to know my age? You are just uh, 22. Me, 22. But you are looking like a 50 old man. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it, it, are you sure? Uh, mm -hmm. I'm like 50 years old man. Wow. <laughs> and I'm also what? I'm 60 plus. Oh, you are 60 plus. And I'm looking like what? 33 year old. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, so there are many factors that contribute to your aging fast. So these are few we want to bring to okay. you. And if we try to avoid these things and eliminate certain things in our what? A lifestyle this is going to help us to slow down the aging process. We know whatever you do, you age, uh -huh, but then we should not hasten it. Yeah, let's be fit, let's be healthy. So US, mm, you can go and read about dermatology, you know, it's the area of science that focuses on diseases yeah. affecting the human body, such <laughs> as the, the skin, the hair, the nails, and the mucous <laughs> membrane. Yeah. So, when we do more research about dermatology, you know things to eat and what not to do so that we will slow down the rate of aging, you know. We need to enjoy life a bit. So I want to throw this challenge to all the food channels on YT Street that when you are cooking, many people have been copying or learning from you. Okay. So when you put on too much, put in too much, uh, what? Spice. Spices. Spices. Yeah. Uh -huh. Someone, some, somewhere what? might think that is good. Okay. And uh, maybe the thing is even not good. Sure. Yeah, health, so yeah. they should rather promote healthy foods so that people can live longer well, some, and some, take some, care some of people their people are like ulcer, ulcerous patients or that they have uh, ulcer. ulcer. Mm. Uh -huh. If you have ulcer, you don't need spice mm. So the whole thing is something. Yeah, people love spice. Yeah. Like uh, uh, Udemaya wife when yeah, she was prepared, yeah, wow. that reaction we did. Oh, okay. Too much spice. Oh, okay. And the food was spicy. That the father could not eat. There uh -huh. was too much pepper. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, and uh, I think we did a reaction oh, on that. Yeah, yeah. And so we need to avoid this thing because I want everybody to live a healthy life. Sure. Be fit and then avoid hospitals by eating the right type of food. Sure. And then things will work out Take well it. for us. So, mm. so that's all we have for you today. Davis. Yeah. So until we see you in our next video, stay healthy live a healthy life sure. avoid all these things we said yeah. because if you try to take them you are on your own you'll be paying much money for medicinal purposes thank you and bye bye we love you